Hey nerds, welcome back to Nerd News, I'm going to stay down now. Today, we're going to be talking about some San Diego Comic Con news. Yes, I know it was a couple of weeks ago, but I was away at camp and I was unable to post some stuff. So let's talk about it now. And what we're going to be talking about is Green Lantern Corps, the movie. So there's some news from Jeff Johns himself, who uh, was working on it, but I think he still will be, but a little less hands-on as he was before. Um, so yeah, let's get right into it. First, he kind of said it's very different from the first one. It's different in the sense that it's going to be a corpse movie instead of just a Hal Jordan movie, which is a very interesting concept because the first one was all about Hal Jordan, his love interests, and not really about the core, but like less about the core and more about his life of being a superhero and how to balance all that. A very basic origin movie, which was bad. Anyway, this movie will have John Sir, which is not new news. We knew that this was kind of going to be a buddy cop movie about the Green Lantern Corps itself, which is an interesting concept, but there might be some flaws in there. But uh, Jeff Johns did relate this movie to Green Lantern 2004 Rebirth. Now, if you don't know that storyline, it's um about Green Lantern. Basically, all of Jeff Johns' is Rebirth when he's done Rebirth on the Flash. And I'm not talking about the 2016 version, but, like, the way back 2004 version. And Rebirth's mostly, like, kind of, like, setting up a character, like, kind of having a whole new, like, starting a new story and kind of redemption. So the whole thing about 2004 Rebirth of Green Lantern is Hal Jordan coming up from redemption because he was Parallax, was a villain who killed millions, and so now he's back. Why would that be a movie about the Green Lantern Corps when that's mostly Hal Jordan? Yeah, it's a very weird concept of why that would be the... It's a great story. It's a great story. Uh, Green Lantern Rebirth 2004. It's one of my favorite graphic novels of all time. But that's not a very good starting of a m movie series. Like the Green Lantern, which I assume they're going to do multiple ones, like they would do Man of Steel or Wonder Woman or any kind of superhero trilogy... It would just be kind of weird to do that and that be the start. Maybe the end where, okay, Hal Jordan and Jon Stewart, obviously. I'm still thinking that this is a Hal Jordan singular movie. But let's just say, okay, the first movie, it's like you defeat a villain, basic, you know, get to know all the characters. Second one, Hal Jordan goes crazy and he ruins a bunch of shit, uh, shit because of his tragedy. <clears throat> and then the third one is about his redemption. This would be like a great Send off or a great ending, but a start like this, like you would have to, like for Green Lantern Rebirth, it was really hard to follow because you would you need to know like years of shit, like why he became Parallax in the first place. But like, I'm just kind of confused. It's a great story if they can work it out. Jeff Johns would be the man too, but it's just a very confusing story and it's very weird. Comment down below your thoughts on it. But that's mostly what we learned about the Green Lantern Corps movie so far. There's not a set release date. This may not even happen because of the DCU sucking bad right now and barely making any money. So we'll see. But I'm confused mostly. And kind of worried a little bit. I hope this is going to be good. But I hope. I don't know. Anyway, comment down below your thoughts in the comment section down below. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. This is Nerd News. Sign off.